Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Saira Kuri, and today we're going to look at 12 inexpensive ways to make your home look elegant and high-end, no matter what your interior design style is. The tips we're going to see today are general guidelines that everyone can use to make their home more pleasant to the eyes. They are simple tips, but I assure you they make a huge difference in how your home looks and feels. Let's go into the first step, which is use neutrals as a base. A neutral color palette is something that many luxurious spaces have in common. Neutral color schemes feel calm, classic, and clutter-free. A way to start is to use neutrals for any big ticket items like floors, area rugs, big furniture or wall coverings, and use accessories to introduce other colors textures and patterns. This gives you the versatility to change the appearance of your home by changing inexpensive things such as pillows, faces, decor pieces, and so on. With neutrals as a base, you can create a focal point, which is my next tip. A bold a statement wall can create an upscale feel. And the best part is that the treatment doesn't have to be expensive and you can do it yourself very quickly. You can pick a contrasting paint color or wallpaper to add movement and a dramatic effect. Try these wall treatments in spaces such as an entryway, dining room, powder room, walk-in closet to add style while keeping costs low. If you're not sure how to pick the perfect wall to be the focus, don't worry because I have a video for you where I reveal designer secrets to create a bold statement through focal points. I leave you the link up here and in the description box below. Let's dive into the third tip, which is hanging floor to ceiling drapes. This is a great trick because it helps enhance the visual height of the space by drawing the eye upward. This makes the space feel more airy and open. Make sure to hang the curtain rod high and wide. Ensure to have curtain rods that can extend about 3 to 6 inches from both the lateral ends of your windows. It will help the windows look larger and prevent the panels from blocking the natural light as well. Another way I love to transform a home on a budget is to paint old wooden furniture, cabinets, or doors. It's something that you can do yourself at a low cost. Sand off all the old paint or finish and repaint them in an elegant new color to match the rest of your decor and style. For example, if your kitchen cabinets have a faded natural wood color, repaint them matte black, gray, white, or another neutral color for a more contemporary update. If you love colors and want something different and fresh, you can select an elegant blue or green tone. Those colors are also a good idea to freshen up your bathroom by painting the vanity. If you want to add texture, you can add moldings to a flat cabinet surface to make it more contemporary and luxurious. Another great way to update your home is by painting boring old doors. Pick a neutral color or a bold one to add life to your interior in an authentic but budget-friendly way. I recommend a matte finish when selecting the paint because it looks more elegant and contemporary yet timeless and goes well with other surfaces and finishes. Talking about renovating old furniture and cabinets, another tip is to elevate the look by switching out the hardware. I think this is the most effective and fast update you can make to your home. Immediately, you can transform the appearance of your kitchen or bathroom by changing the faucet, door knobs, and handles. Pick accessories that stand out by their shape or color to complement your space. In case you are low budget, you can opt for painting your old handles and knobs with high quality paint. In minutes, you can transform your old cabinets or furniture. Speaking of details that make a huge difference, I want to introduce the next tip. Incorporate bold and authentic accessories. 
The next time you go shopping, look for authenticity. Forget about having ordinary pieces that don't have any special characteristic. Instead, look for vases with unusual shapes, textures, and size, unique candle holders or trays, and combine them looking for contrast. This video is sponsored by the Interior Design Masterclass. This masterclass is a course that I have structured to combine my academic and professional experience into 12 modules that will teach you everything you need to know to become an expert interior designer in no time. The course teaches you the basics of interior design from general theories like design principles, how to think like a real designer, color theory, lighting, space planning, software and applications to learning how to create your own successful business by developing your branding, learning how to work with real clients and how to develop a project step-by-step -step using a proof methodology and so much more. If you feel like it's time to follow your passion and take your first step, be it designing your own home or enhancing your interior design career, I would love to help you with this learning process. I am very excited to receive you in my virtual classroom and to start this journey with you. Go now to the interiordesignmasterclass.com if you want more information about it and enroll. I will leave the link below. My next tip on making your space look luxurious in a budget is by giving your plain, boring walls an update with some molding. Moldings are an affordable way to add dimension to the space, especially when the walls are painted in neutral colors. Something important to consider if you plan to add molding to your interiors is the style of your home. We can indeed mix and match styles. Actually, contemporary spaces look fantastic with moldings. But make sure to pick the appropriate style for your room. Leave high ornate molding for a more classic style and select a more clean and simple molding to match it with more contemporary and modern decor. For example, you can mix the classic appearance of molding with a minimalist space, but make sure the molding helps to maintain the clean look that characterizes minimalism. Talking about minimalism, a trend that I love is to have natural branches in beautiful bases. It's a way to have nature inside without spending a lot of money on fresh flowers. It adds movement, shape, and texture. The best part is that you can bring the three branches that fall from your yard. It's beautiful, elegant, authentic, and it's free. We talk about this trend in my video about warm minimalism. If you like simplicity and warm spaces, make sure to click the link up here or down below to bring this unique and elegant look to your home. To take care of the finishing touches is essential. Another vital detail to consider is overfilled pillows. Fill the throw pillow covers with slightly larger inserts than the covers, about one or two inches larger. Also, pick inserts with a good quality that can give the pillow a good shape. By doing this, your decor will look more sophisticated, elegant, and will transmit a sense of comfort and luxury. Amplifying the space and letting the natural light in is a good trick to make the room look luxurious and airy. An efficient way to achieve this is by incorporating large mirrors to reflect the light and space. Before you hang a mirror, take into account what is across it. For the best result, hang it across from a window. It will increase the amount of light in the room. Also, don't forget that mirrors tend to create a bold statement in interior design. So be careful with the shape, style, and size, especially if you want to have them as focal points. Talking about hanging things on the walls, I want to talk about the following tip. Updating your home's artwork with one statement piece. Gallery walls can work very well depending on the style and kind of space. But if you're looking to have a more sophisticated and luxurious look, it will be great to have one big and bold painting instead of a composition of small pieces. When you hang an oversized piece of art, it has a significant impact. Still, at the same time, the space will look more clean and organized.
And my last tip is to update all light fixtures. Like mirrors and wall art, lamps are expressive and are vital elements to create focal points. They catch our eyes quickly, so we need to say goodbye to old or standard lighting fixtures. They are inexpensive options that can help you see your space in a whole new light. For example, you can add an oversized pendant lamp over a kitchen island, dining room or hallway, or you can have a composition of smaller lamps. Wall lamps hung above night tables or in the powder room always bring elegance and authenticity. Regardless the style of your space, layering lighting is necessary. Make sure to distribute them evenly in the space. Remember to use warm lights and dimmers whenever possible to make it feel cozy. I have multiple videos talking about lighting layers and how to pick lamps for your home. Make sure to click the links in the description box below. I don't want to finish this video without giving you an extra tip that I consider fundamental to get a unique and luxurious look. This extra tip is to apply the concept of less is more at home. Embracing minimalism and the clutter in the space is the starting point to get a high-end look. You need to clear out the unnecessary things that are not functional or you don't love anymore and give the critical pieces of the space to breathe. Incorporate hidden storage to declutter your space, place decorative bowls or baskets to store things like kids' toys, remote controls, documents, and so on. You can use baskets or boxes to hide electronic devices and to avoid visible cables as well. Guys, this is all for today. I hope you like these easy tips and that you get inspired to make your home more beautiful and cozy. Don't forget to smash the like button, share and subscribe to support this channel. I will appreciate it a lot. Thanks for watching. Have a beautiful week. See you in the next one.